Hey guys, today I am going to talk about kind of the state of Magic the Gathering right now and maybe why um, you should not, you know, play Magic the Gathering right now. Do I think the game has a future? Yes, I do. But right now, not so much. I think taking a break isn't the worst idea, right? Uh, so here we have an, a player, and on their Force of Wills, obviously Teresa Nielsen got cancelled by Autumn Bercelli. Autumn Bercelli was the MPL winner. They them decided when they no longer could win that the best way to get attention and coverage was then to go after a lesbian artist. And legendarily, she wrote um, trans rights or human rights and no turfs on girl and so on. On Teresa Nielsen's, uh, what is it called? Not dual lands. They're like um, moon lands. I, you know, it's been such a long time ago and I've cared so, you know, I cared so much about it. It's kind of weird that I don't remember it. But uh, they were very expensive lands. And that was the idea. The idea was to go ahead and absolutely obliterate uh, even now Teresa Nielsen is not allowed by Wizards of the Coast to produce artwork for them and that really in my opinion is a shame because her artwork is one of the reasons many people play Magic the Gathering uh, in the Odin days right Force of Will again another iconic card I think the artwork just went for sale uh, for a few hundred thousand dollars which you know good on her hopefully Teresa Nielsen gets part of that money if not, it just kind of shows you the demand and the potential that she had uh, with Magic the Gathering. Now, I want to go back to like here you have Solidarity with DPRK. I had no idea what that meant until I Googled it. It's the Democratic Republic of Korea. So it's not South Korea. It's North Korea. So I'm not sure what that means. Uh, maybe I'm just old, a dinosaur. I'm not in on the in crowd. But apparently he um, defaced them a few years ago. Solidarity with Palestine. And then uh, the other two is Abolish... What was that? Abolish Bail, maybe? Anyway, we'll find out what the other two... And but the other one, trans rights, is human rights. When... It's very interesting, you know, the same people, I bet you this guy, if he saw an anime playmat, and he would be very offended by that playmat, some of these playmats, yet he's 100% okay with writing this stuff, which may offend, you know, uh, other people, players. Um, once Magic gets political, I'm out, because there's nothing you can do. Um, let me just be 100 with you. Um, they will get you. They will cancel you. They will destroy your business. They will leave you bad Google reviews, which I've already shown time and time again. These are the individuals that I am most worried about. Um, and you might be like, why are you so worried? No, it, it's really because they have nothing to lose. You know, of all the animals in the jungle, the lion's actually not the... The lion is not actually the most ferocious and are the one that you should be afraid of. It's the dog with nothing to lose. It's the jackal who is willing to risk life and limb just to get that extra piece of meat. You don't want to mess with that person. They have nothing to lose. So in my opinion, people who, I mean, look at 420. Aha, Rudy Chan. He's a Rudy Chan fan, right? Must be. Um, you, you got this issue, and it's a it's a big issue, my dudes. Like, I, I'm trying to explain this in ways that I'm not going to directly get their ire but I, I don't think i can the issue is quite obvious to me um the issue is really that you have an oh abolish ice which is the immigration right so they want everyone to be able to immigrate and abolish ice and uh trans rights so those are the four issues again the dprk i'm i've never seen that before like isn't that like north korea like why would you stand with north korea against like what the Democratic Party of Republic of North Korea, DPRK. DPRK. North Korea, yes. Yeah, North. It's the Democratic People's Republic of North of Korea. 
and con- constitutes the northern half of Korean Peninsula. Yeah, it's that's North Korea. Okay, their supreme leader is Kim Jong Un. So why are we going to stand with him? Like against what? Like, like and does he even understand that in North Korea they don't have trans rights and they definitely have ICE. They have their own version where that's why like no one like leaves and no one comes into North Korea. ICE is immigration, right? I'm pretty sure that's what he's referring to. And yeah, it's bizarre. A lot of bizarre things happening. And I just don't want to play magic with these players. Like, honestly, like, I don't want to get into a debate about this and that and this and that because it's not good for business. It's not good for your mental stability. It's not good for any of this stuff, right? And the fact that they're still doing this to Teresa's artwork is, you know, you see the little lines on the bottom, they crossed out her name. So not only did they permanent marker, like, just these things, random things on their artwork, uh, they also uh, crossed out her name, when in fact, if they were so offended, they could just get new versions of it. I think there's, like, eight more new versions of Forza Will, right? That has been reprinted with different artwork. And I don't know why they do they just I think like they do it for attention. I'm not positive guys. Like I don't really know. Like I just know um Autumn Bruccelli has no Twitch followers, even though they spent a hundred million dollars I cannot believe this. They spent a hundred money having million dollars promoting this. This is where the money went. If you want to know why all those people got laid off, man, the, the CEO he got a nine million dollar bonus, but they spent ten million dollars just that year on promoting the NPL, which is a disaster. I hate the NPL. Like, everything that is wrong with inequality, everything that's wrong with social justice is basically the NPL and a nutshell, in my personal opinion. Um, and they promoted it. That was a $100 million project over 10 years, so $10 million a year. Man, why you got to fire all these people? Why don't you just get rid of the NPL is my question. Because then, I mean, I guess they did get rid of it eventually. So, I mean, I don't want to play with these guys. You know, I don't want to play with these day-dems and the hymns and herds. I don't want to play with a guy even doing this because it's just not beneficial, like, to get into, oh, hey, you know, hey, I'm going to use my force of will, uh, solidarity with the the Republic of Korea, North Korea. It's like, okay. I mean, thanks for letting me know. Oh, let me explain you the whole demographic thing. No, I'm just here to play effing magic. Get the F out. So, um, yeah, I mean, this is probably one of the reasons I would not open a store, to be quite frank with you, because I do not want to deal with this. Uh, Because you know they're coming. You know they, they, them, he, she, like, they're all coming. They're coming to my store to make demonstrations. Anyway, bye, guys.